Good morning. Good morning, Allie. Good morning, children at home. Well, <laughs> well, this morning, I think we should all get focused together, right? So can you do what I do just like this? Can you do what I do just like this? And can you do what I do just like this? Can you do what I do just like this? And can you do what I do just like this? Can you do what I do just like this? Well, it's good to be able to gather here at church together. And some of you might be still at home uh, joining us together. And Ali, I see you have another stuffy with you today. Well, this morning I was thinking about there might be some words that we say every Sunday morning that you may have noticed. I know... Children, you are very, very observant, and you notice some very, very special things that sometimes big people don't even notice. Well, there's one part of the service, and it's going to be coming up soon, where we say the word of the Lord, and then everyone else says, together, thanks be to God, right? Let's try it again. The word of the Lord. This is part of the service we always say, and I've always wondered, what do these words really mean? The word of the Lord. Well, I think we all know what a word is. I want to show you something, Ali. These are some different kinds of Bibles. This Bible, it's a big one. I was given this maybe when I was about 12 years old, and it's a big one. I have a, this is my Bible I use every day now, and the church has different Bibles too, and things like that, and these are actually very, very special books, and I know, children, you love to read books. Ali, I know you love books as well. Well, when we say the word of the Lord, we're actually saying something very special about this book, the Bible. That's not just an ordinary book, but it's actually a message. It's like a letter that's been written to you, Ali, and written to me, and written to everyone here. And so whenever we read the Bible on our Sunday, we always say, the word of the Lord, because it's something very special God gave us. So we're always thankful when we hear it, because we know it's a very, very special message to us. So, Ali and children at home, you might love it when someone reads a story to you. Maybe before bedtime, someone reads a story to you. Well, the Bible is a very, very special kind of story that's meant for all of us to know and hear. And so every time we read it up here, we'll say the word of the Lord and thanks be to God because it is a very special book we give thanks for. Um, so, Ali, as you get older, children, as you get older, one of the most important books you will learn to read and understand is this. And in fact, today... After our service, there's a special class we're having where people are going to get together to learn more about the Bible and learn how to understand this very, very special book that God has written to us. So that's kind of my message for today. We're going to pray that we give thanks for this. Oh, I had other pictures of Bibles here too. But we're going to pray together and give thanks that God gave us his word. So children, together, let's bow our heads and let's pray. Dear Jesus, thank you for giving us the Bible. Your words are so true and so good. Thank you that your words help teach us who you are. Help us understand that it is your word. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. All right, thanks, Allie. Thanks, children. Well, next we'll have the scripture readings. <laughs> 